lesbians dive into the movie world and like straight like okay cool so Trevor Noah right now he could do a movie he hasn't done one yet mm. maybe he has maybe he's featured no it's mostly adverts mm. so uh, Kevin Hart is now into movies and all of that what's your take on that because I know Ukat Williams was saying a whole lot of stuff <laughs> about that but you know we ain't about to talk about that but like what's your take on that like comedians turning into movie stars and maybe not being so funny anymore on screen the, um, my take on that is movie, movies are the end goal for comedy like the idea is okay. I tell, I tell, it's like telling a joke with this much room when you get to movies you're given a whole room to tell this joke like you meaning we're here to make the joke even bigger with sure. the movie so it is the end goal to get to movies to tell jokes at a bigger scale hold people's attention for a longer time that's the whole idea for it and um i would say that seeing the some of them transitioning to movies and you saying some of them end up not being funny i think that um a lot of them are struggling to really um, how can I put it? Um, seek out the discipline in this industry of comedy. True. It's not good enough that you can make people laugh. You need to know how to. Your body language needs to know how to make people laugh. You know your your facial expressions. Everything about you needs to be humor when you represent humor, and True. that's why it only makes sense to end up in movies. Okay, so ha- acting is also a result of comedy or it's needed for comedy i mean i mean when i watch comedy shows <clears throat> especially in the beginning they always have certain characters that they bring out of the boxes and all of that like what is your favorite character to pull out of the hat <clears throat> who's your favorite gay like are you saying character that i play yeah you the one you enjoy the most the one you know that kills everyone I started exploring characters last year, so I'm still I'm enjoying this, man. I haven't it's even, fun, hey. It's fun. <laughs> Yo, I still want to play a dog catcher. I still want to play an attorney. I still want to, and there's so much humor you can twist in all these things you can play. So True. I'm still yet to I'm still yet to answer that question. Yeah, I think I think you're healing the world with the craft that you do because you turn such a boring job into something that is realistic because we relate eh? people relate hey. and, and, hey. and when it's happening to them they're just like oh. you know and then when they see you doing it they're like Aish, you know i think you're healing society in what you're doing um have people told you about how inspirational you've been you uh, me no i know like um oh, I, I won't, i'm saying too, you're yes. like yes they, they have <laughs> like i think the the most shocking one is people recognizing you in public. That's unexplainable. Are you serious? You like just coming here alone, you know? People are like skiff, skiff. It's, it's like I used to do music for like a good amount of time of my life, and I wanted to be known. Get this right, I tried to be known. Yeah. People never noticed me, and now when I'm doing something where I'm just like making myself laugh and making people laugh, they see you. It's it's. It's unexplainable till today. It's artistry. It's a talent that needed to be coming out, Miss. You know how we do this. All right, so let's close. Hey, what? What? Who's the last person you blocked on WhatsApp? <gasps> Sorry? Who is the last person that you blocked on WhatsApp? Is the question the ghost is asking? Hey, the ghost, matter the ghost, the ghost, too. Yo, the last, hey. person, the last person I blocked is this other female person. Hi, boo. And um, what happened was, she literally, <laughs> I'm, like, I was, I, I was flattered. Don't get me wrong, I was happy. She pulled out her Ooh. phone and she was doing one of those, I'm gonna expose you, what, what things. And I was like, oh. wait, expose me for what? Number one, we're not doing anything. But number two, it was the first time someone ever threatened my image. I was like, mm. oh shit, am I there now? Am I that big? Oh. Sure. <laughs> Yo, guys, no, that's true. No, dude, that's true. That's Wait, true. Where did you meet the girl, bro? It's just the girl that I know from Johannesburg when I was living in Maboneng. Ah, chosy girl. Eish. Ah, Maboneng hands. Eish. Eish. No, guys, shame. But you know what? It's, I think it's it, the better thing to have done was to block her and not engage any further. Yeah. Um, I think the last person, can I also say who I blocked last? <laughs> 
It was my nephew. How? No, 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 no. I oh. had to. This boy, this boy, guys. You know, let's say, okay, we had we had a family gathering, you know, Nandi. <laughs> Mom's buying everyone drinks. You know, the drinks are in the packet and it's your house. So, I mean, the house, you're shine. Yeah. You can take out as many as you want anytime, whatever. It's going in, it's going in, it's going in. Not this guy telling my mom how many I'm taking every time. And he's like a 18 or 17 teenager, annoying teenager. I'm like, I'm going to block you. I have no more your aunt. It's mm. over, bro. Mm. It's done, and I, was, I took it so personally because I didn't I get tell. to enjoy. I, I didn't get to enjoy that free trials. So I blocked my little nephew. How long has he been blocked for now? It's about two years now. Let it go. I will never. Let it I go. Can't. Blood. Let it go. I can't. What if he needs you today, bro? And he's a musician now. <laughs> he needs you, dog. No, guys. Let me, go, I can. Dude. I graduate. I can hold it. Eh? Share a joke or two. Smoke me, a plant or two. I, I can't. Go. Me, I graduate. I can hold. Mm. Me, I graduate. I can hold. Where do we see Scafe in the next five years? Let's close this and wrap up this show with see? all its drama and laughter. But you didn't give us a joke, but it's fine. Where do we see next next five years? Yeah, five. Give um, us like you know. Have you noticed that in life, when you future prospector size, if that's even a word for yourself? Yeah. Tolo Guti, you'll be looking back in five years at this podcast and be like, damn, I mentioned this. Facts. So give it to the universe. Why not? Hold on, stop on. I'm like, the question is for you, bro. Okay. Do, How do you, you think? <laughs> Why didn't you ask this whole time? Okay, I didn't want to go. Shantua I'm checking my Shantua. time. At, at I'm not leaving now. Right? I'm not leaving. But why were you quiet this whole time? I'm not a ghost. Okay, ah, you, you terrible. You, <laughs> you must edit yeah, this thing like a... What type of honeys that irritates you? What type of? Honeys? Do what? What type of honeys irritates you? What Hurt type of irritate me? You. Oh, um... Definitely... Definitely girls that like attention, that don't just know, like, how to share a good joke. I don't like a girl that likes attention. In which way? Taking no, no, no. That... No, likes attention, <laughs> like <laughs> uh, pa, pa. You know, like yeah, like, like me na, like no, me na. Like... Like... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like no, mangi no, no, If I was in jail, no, if, I was, like, if I was in jail, if I was in jail, yes, if I was young, chami, you wanna go? Skiffy, skiffy, send us hanging in prison. Dude, I actually I won't even lie to you. Like, the past few years, like, 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 I haven't really interacted with females in that way. Like I've just been making them laugh. So when they see me, they just laugh. We keep it casual. <laughs> so I don't want to talk bad on them, bro. Honestly. Sure. We're your biggest fans. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, but I still ask you, eh? Nah, what names do you plan to call you? Hey, bro. Ghost, bro. Ghost, guys. Ghost <laughs> must stay a ghost. She you calls understand? me Scape. Everyone calls me Scape, bro. <laughs> Come on, go if we, if, if, if She calls him, like, she probably calls him babe, love, sugar pie, boo, mm. my man, my you? thing in the space. Woo, my man in the space. Oh, there's my man, yeah, there's the my answer. man, there's my man. Hey, you having skip, skip. I'm having, he doesn't, I bo, I bo, I bo. I don't no, 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 shame. No, 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 no. Next question, let's go. Let's go. Ask me any question you want. Another one. Another I'll try. If you go to a media tour with these two artists, who would you choose to go with? You know Uncle Waffles? Uncle Waffles? You or? You know... Uh, come up there, I suppose. You know Come up there? Yeah, I've heard of her, yeah. So, who would you choose to like, invest a camera and Coca-Cola and say, Skiff, I'm going to be on the big post. I want you to go to one of these two. <gasps> and you're going to a tour in London, you're going to sleep in one hotel. I don't know. Um, I might not even do it. You won't do the campaign? Yeah, I might not. I might not recover from that campaign. You have to understand, dog, I follow Trevor Noah's blueprint. And if you do that in comedy, you can easily be thrown out as someone who was trying to be famous. And you weren't even trying that. You were just there to do work. So you have to really make the right decisions, not the... The quickest decision. True. You know what I'm saying? Because mm. being there with Waffles, come on, bro, we know what she stands for. I stand for a totally different thing, and yes, we might get work done. What but... does Waffles stands for? Mm. Waffles. Yeah. 
Is that a question? She stands for it's music, DJing, stands, fashion. Oh, yes, I mean, she, yeah, there. She stands for music. Yo, what's DJ. going on with you? I'm like, crazy, bro. Okay, so let me just say this. Guys, okay, let me say this right now. She's an she's a international DJ for a dance genre. That's what she's known for, mm-hmm. Uncle Waffles. And to align an international dance DJ with a comedian would be a terrible play. We would never recover from that. Because they would ask us, what were you doing there? Genres. Cause, yeah, because our people I, I are not... Mean, I, I would just let it slide, but I just don't get the fact that it's a South African comedian with a South African DJ yeah. on the European tour, a Coca-Cola tour. I mean, I just, I just don't see the harm. Maybe I'm briley with the man, but anyway... Bro, have you ever seen in any like history, like uh, uh, let's use Dave Chappelle. Have you ever seen Dave Chappelle headline anything with the DJ? I mean, we can't be living in the past. <laughs> you also, have you ever seen hardcore beats being the biggest on the planet? Facts. You know, so we, we there's a lot of things we have never seen, but we can do. Ah, but we can't, we can't lose the arts in the process. We can't, bro. You know Marvel Records. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir, the biggest majority shares to Universal. So what are you trying to say? What I'm trying to say is, we can be having the arts, but the money and the business can change how we live. You know what I mean? I mean, you, Maverick is the biggest record label on, on, on Africa. You know what I mean? They got Rama, they got, they made, a couple of big artists we all know you know what I'm saying but don't just they put the money there thinks about his kids but man tomorrow that will happen to my piano man you never know it's a, it's a growing genre of music right now mm. so like what I'm trying to say I don't know I'll be maybe blinded by money but I think it'll be really more for a South African DJ and you have to choose one either come on man or Afros and we do it Bro, I would, I would rather go with Pearl Tusi and um, Boiti. Like we can strike more funny things with those people. Sure, you they've know got a I'm lot saying? of nice drama. They wouldn't mind you, you know joking what I'm about. Oh man, you know what? That's actually nice. You know, um, it's it's very hard to find artists that are still steadfast on their their puzzle pieces in their journey you know they're not buying a full puzzle nor trying to mm-hmm. have the same pieces uh, have the same puzzle look like someone else's puzzle but they're using the same steps of success that other people use to build their puzzles mm-hmm. and now they have full circle um stronghold rooted careers and i think the way you're going about it is so inspirational especially to people who'll be watching and who now know you better um, because now they know that it's, there's no easy way to success nor should we take shortcuts and just because mang mang is famous mm. Mm. Ribe, mm. in the same no guys mm. sometimes i am success even on my own in mm. my pace in my lane as a comedian yalla first on boom I'm, I'm, I'm a big bad guy right you are the bad guy ghost. <laughs> oh my gosh. I think she's not funny. <gasps> yeah. It's okay. <laughs> yeah. But I'll ask you this question. If, if you're in the room, eh? Oh, you, say you say something not funny. And you see someone laughing. What, what do you think about it? I say, first of all, you say she's not funny. That's that's okay. Yeah. You know, you're allowed to say someone's not funny. You're not you're not wrong for saying that. But that's that's humor, bro. Like that's mm-hmm. why. I, I don't believe in writing a joke the intent to make someone laugh no I believe in you being yourself and people are laughing at you being yourself true because you can never go wrong there I wasn't trying to make you laugh so when you say something that's not funny like you know this is not funny yeah and then you laugh. laugh I laugh with you you laugh with me yeah <laughs> like, <laughs> like I'm saying you know what we need to save chickens and then yeah. you laugh I mean, I have no idea. Uh, this is a bad job man you'll be seeing someone Walking arrogantly, what, what, boom, and then here maybe they trip, they fall, or maybe they get robbed. <laughs> you know, oh shit, they're robbing this guy, and then they start laughing all the way. No like, shame, the, you the won't entire, laugh. The entire strategy came about. 
you know what I mean? Remember, you can't play hero. <laughs> Too much that is. It's not funny, you know what I mean? <laughs> You know what's so also what's funny? Your, what's your point? Your, but you also your storytelling skills. Your story <laughs> may be boring, ne? But your storytelling skills yes. is what we're laughing at. Yes, we're so you're a good performer, day. Uh, well, my dad is well. Some things are not funny, but people laugh. Yes. Why? So what, what do you what, what would you tell me? I'm like I feel like this. Not, I'm like sometimes I just feel like things are not funny. Like you don't need to laugh. And when niggas laugh, I laugh too. <laughs> oh, no, no, you got a problem. I got a problem. <laughs> yeah, you, no, 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 you have a problem. Bro. You got problems, problem, son. No, no, but it's like, bro, it's, it's not that deep, really. It's just humor. You if you don't, if you don't. A sense of humor. How do you define having a sense of humor? What is a sense of humor? Because there are people who don't. Okay, let me say, right? I feel sometimes shy to laugh while I'm watching Abu Trip. Wow. The crowd goes wild. But I think because I'm also, I like making jokes also as a person, I don't laugh, I absorb the joke. I see what you mean. And I like it and I'm impressed, but I don't laugh. I can't, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I'm more like, I think you know. So she's um, not funny, like she's confessing, bro. Ah, I'm no, not talking about. She's not talking about her. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, are you having me, ghost? So I was gonna say that on your end, when that happens, I I totally understand what you mean, and I think that it's very very important to reciprocate this thing you want. Oh, true. You know, if you see someone who's a singer, you know, go stream their song, especially if they're not known. You know, like, I, I practice this energy balance very thoroughly. I don't play with that. So, mm. I love. I love you let it I, out. Because I want it to come back to me, too. Aww. Yeah. Okay, I hear you then. That's fine. Are you a solid out now, person? Now. I mean, if we have the means and the resources to do it now. I'm solid now. Yes, 100%. You go to street now? Hey, boy. No. He no, can't. I've never been there in my life, bro. No, no, ghost. No. Do you think strippers, they want to love? They do. They're girls. <laughs> and they're your fans. Come on, boy. What's up? <laughs> Come on. Don't be prejudiced where you find them. As long as they're laughing. It would, it would, would, be, you, you, it would be a killer one, though. <laughs> like, imagine. <laughs> imagine. You, niggas you know. trying to give money there. Bums there. Poles there. Jokes there. Jokes there. You know, it would be a lot. It would be too much. Yo, next thing I'm going to say, I'm going to say, yes, I'm going to say, it would be love. a mess. Or no, someone's no, trying to give money. Now the intention is on you. No, 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 no. no. Stolen business. What's up, brother? That's what I say he's in the room. No, I think that that's a that's a legendary gig. What the one at the strip? Yeah, or? I think you know who would who would who who could pull something like that off? Who? A Kevin Hart, because he's short, and the strippers are tall. Well, the stigma of it, I mean, and him having like maybe just two stripper poles on his stage. And then the strippers just doing their also thing, like and facts. he's American also gonna. It's being motivated by strippers. It's what? It's motivated, motivated by, by strippers. strippers. Like what? When you go watch them comment, you uh, all the comments talk about the strippers talk about the comments. Like go to stand up comments. It's sex, it's but it's more sex jokes, what not I'm specifically trying, for what strippers. I'm trying to say is the jokes. Last time I was in the strip club, and then boom. She did this. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's all about this. Strip culture. No you know shame. I mean? Not all. Uh... Bro, go, 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 go do enough research about them. No, I, I get what you mean. You know what yeah, mean? strip culture is big. That's it. Yeah. So, I just think. Like, I think it's sex culture. Okay. My, my main skiff is too clean, is moving like a cold drink. That's when I mix it with a oh, little oh, bit of lean. Oh, What's going on oh, here? Yeah. Oh. Are you rapping? I love that. Hey, my boy. Shout out for pulling up. <laughs> Away, Away. Yo, okay, Mr. Ghost with all of his ghastly questions for our talented scape in the building. Thank Wait, you. Wait, hang on. I want to say this on the record. On the record? Yes. Uh -huh. You said you do comedy. I can try it. She said she does comedy. I can try it. No, then this is. But I am funny, shame. I do have funny videos on my Instagram too. 
Okay, we're gonna do a skit now. Ah, what, 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 what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try, but I, <laughs> I hate you guys. Thank you. How do we do this thing? What am I supposed to do? Okay, I think you can close the show first and then we can get to the skit. Okay. I just wanted to get that on record that you said you do this. So if you back out, you'd be going against your word. I'm not going to back. I'm not a backing out kind of person. I'm independent. Yes. Remember, I can oh, use the mouse yeah. now. Okay. I can press record on my own now. Okay. I'm independent. Okay. I'm independent. Ooh. I can't do this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> my DMs family, yo. What a funny episode with Mr. Scape right here. I'm Chantal Worldwide. Thank you guys for tuning in. Catch us on all social handles. Please, can you just Scape, tell them where man. to find Scape? I love you, South Africa. I love that. <laughs> I'm asking this question. He's like scared, man. Just we ask our guests. Okay. What do you understand about the comedy industry that you think other comedians don't understand and will never understand? That was a good one. But I think yes, what yes. they I think writing they, they don't understand the importance of writing the, um just the art of writing do you find the joke in the process of writing and that's just i guess that's what i think they don't understand i'm seeing a lot of we're the taking pen game the pen game yeah we're taking a lot of audios and redoing renditions that's lame you know we're supposed to be writing the plots writing the hook writing the joke you know